Hello. Have you ever felt nervous or been so worried about something that you ended up with a terrible headache? What might have caused those worries? Was it stress in multiple areas of your life? Were you feeling out of control? Were you not seeing an answer for the stress in sight? Was there a family fight? Have you had times when you were worried about something so much you had trouble sleeping? We've all been there. Today we're gonna to talk about progressive muscle relaxation, what it is, the benefits, and then try the relaxation technique out. This is the Mental Health Moment brought to you by Illinois Extension. My name is Chelsea Byers and I serve Champaign, Ford, Iroquois, and Vermilion counties. Today's session is to help you understand the negative effects of tension and stress and how progressive relaxation can help you identify tension and learn to relax. The mindfulness technique, progressive muscle relaxation, focuses on your attention to different muscle groups in your body. The idea is to understand and feel the difference between tense muscles and muscles that are in a relaxed state. This technique also helps you um, tighten the muscles and hold them for four to 10 seconds and then allow the muscles to relax completely. We're gonna try guided progressive muscle relaxation. We're gonna start with our toes and work our way up to the head. Some other scripts might flip the script and actually start with your head and work down to your toes. Either method is great for relieving tension. Do you know how it feels to have tense muscles? Have you ever overworked your muscles before by working out, playing sports, or performing physical labor? Many of us have had that feeling. Oftentimes, our body will react to stress with tense muscles. Today, we're gonna to try an activity to help us ease the tension that sometimes can be caused by stress, worry, and anxiety, not from being overworked by playing sports or physical labor. Let's try some progressive muscle relaxation. But first, I want you to get in a comfortable position. Put those feet on the floor, sit up tall and straight, and take a deep breath. I encourage you to shut your eyes if you're comfortable, but if not, have a soft gaze. If you have any areas that are hurting, or if you find an area that hurts during this process, feel free to skip that step. This should not cause you any pain. Again, as we go through this process, we're gonna hold the tense muscle for four to 10 seconds. Today, for time's sake, we're gonna just hold for about four seconds. So we will tense a muscle, hold for four, and then relax completely. Are you ready to begin? Let's start with a deep breath. All right, breathe in. And relax. First, I want you to start by curling your toes. Tighten those toes. Hold. And relax. Now I want you to point your toes up. Lengthen your calves. Point those toes up towards the ceiling. And relax. Working up our legs, I want you to tighten your thighs. Squeeze those thighs together. Hold. And relax. Next, try tightening your buttocks. Squeeze. Hold. and relax. Next, pull in your stomach as if somebody was pulling your belly button into your spine. Hold, keep breathing, and relax. Now, I want you to try to tighten your bicep muscle. If you need to, show me your bicep muscle. Tighten. Hold, and relax. 
Next, raise your arms as if, as if reaching towards the sky. Reach. And relax. Now push your shoulder blades together. Hold. And relax. Shrug your shoulders and put your shoulders up by your ears. Hold. And relax. Now open your mouth as wide as you can. Think of it as if taking a large bite out of something. Or try yawning. Hold it open wide and relax. Now bite down or scrunch your nose. Tighten that face. Hold and relax. Now raise your eyebrows. Raise them up as high as you can. Relax. And finally, smile. Smile as big as you can. And relax. Now take a deep breath. You can shake out all your arms and legs. Did you feel any muscles that were super tense? that once you relaxed, you really felt some relief, that might be a space where you're carrying your stress and tension. I know for myself, it's often in my shoulders. How did this exercise feel for you? If you didn't find much relaxation this time, I encourage you to try it at least another time before you dismiss it. In what situations do you think you could use the progressive muscle relaxation? Oftentimes, people find it helpful after a stressful conversation when they're feeling more tension in their body or when they're trying to fall asleep at night. It's a good way to distract your brain. If you're going through your body and doing that body scan of tensing muscles and relaxing, you can't really keep your mind on other things. This is a good way to engage your brain in a different activity instead of ruminating over something that's stressing you out. I encourage you to try the progressive muscle relaxation to find muscles that are tense and find relaxation. This is your mental health moment and for more activities like this and other ways to manage your stress, visit go.illinois.edu slash manage stress.